What's up guys? Alex Ohm here. Today I'm riding my 2000 R1. It's riding. I just changed the oil. I serviced the chain. But uh, this is my maiden voyage. I'm actually going somewhere. I'm not just riding around. Right now I'm going to work. The last time I rode this bike, uh, second gear is pretty hard to get into. I don't know really why, but I changed the oil and it feels better now. Brakes feel good. Transmission feels good. This bike feels good, man. Feels good indeed. Woo! Yeah, let's go. Let's get a little downshift here. Sounds crispy. Here we go. Mini zero to 60. Let's go. This bike hauls. Oh my gosh, it's so fast. Woohoo! It's so nimble too. I feel like I can just flick it around. And this bike, it's nice, man. Our temps are at 183, so nice and cool. It gets to like 200 when sitting. 220, I think. Kind of scary. I don't think it should get that hot. But here, I'm going to put it in sixth gear, rev it up. Yeah, another clutch is good. Yeah, just so you guys know, a quick test you can do when you're testing a clutch you've never driven before, see if it's slipping or not. You put it in the highest gear, rev it up, drop the clutch. Yeah, this bike is perfect for me, I think. Um, it cost me less than $1,000 to build. And yeah, this bike's pretty fun. Budget build, it's fun. It's fast, sounds good, looks good. I mean, I wanna paint the tank, uh, this front piece and the tail section white. But other than that, uh, I'm gonna leave the bottom, or the frame is gonna stay the bare aluminum. The bottom half of the bike is gonna be black. It's like the wheels are black, the fender's black. I got another fender. I'm conflicted right now whether or not I wanna run it, but I have a fender that I might run. Probably not, but yeah. Motorcycles, R1s, you name it, I got it. Yeah, so like I said, this is my first time riding this bike. It's running. I think I already said that. But, um, yeah, this bike feels good. Like, really good. I also don't know how long it is to take my bike to work. I know in a car it takes about 15 minutes, but yeah. I know when I ride a bike, it's uh, a little bit faster. I can normally shave off a few minutes here and there. And this road just sucks. It's all bumpy and... And now that I'm up to speed, the bike is running at 180. So I think that's good. I think my car runs around there too. I have a 1990 Mazda Miata. It was boosted before I pulled the motor. And uh, I'm currently shaving the bay and tubbing the fenders so I can go more low. This bike feels solid. It's at 170 now. So that's even better. And it's a great day to ride my Project R1 to work. My plans for this bike are get a big old sprocket in the back. And I mainly just want to do this, like ride to work, ride to school, and then stunt a little bit. So I, I know how to do wheelies on mountain bikes and I was starting to get good at wheelies on dirt bikes. So I might as well step it up a little bit and get a real bike. I, I don't think that a 1000 is necessarily the best for stunting but I mean that's what I got so that's what I'm gonna use I've always wanted an R1 and uh, yeah they're pretty cool bikes so I think it's a good bike for me oh boy the torque on this bike is kind of insane dude yeah thank you guys so much for watching 
If you like this video, go ahead, drop a like, subscribe, and share. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.